Welcome to another edition of Whiskey, Games, and Nerd Stuff. Today's whiskey, we are finishing off this bottle of Basil Hayden Dark Rye. As I've mentioned in other videos, I'm a huge fan of Basil Hayden. I like the lower proof when I just want to kind of sip something, make a few videos throughout the day, or just kind of chill out. Um, it's a nice, And it's also a good whiskey to introduce to somebody who isn't necessarily a an experienced whiskey drinker or or gets into scotch this is a nice lower proof it's easy on the palate it's and it's also a good mixer for somebody again people who aren't um you know experienced whiskey drinkers um obviously if you watch the channel you know i, I drink quite a bit of whiskey i like basil hayden i know it gets a lot of bad rap from other people but i like it nonetheless and today's nerd stuff we're going to kind of talk about this Siddle bill from quiver um, just happened to pick this up because I wanted to put a couple blitz decks in it from from fab and I thought it would make a good video So let's go ahead and open up the box Here's what it looks like out of the box. Let's go ahead and take a sip of the basil Hayden real quick mm. I really enjoy that and this isn't gonna be a review of this product if you want to see a good review um, I don't think you can find anything better than uh, the professor at Tolarian Academy, he does a fantastic job. This is just kind of me going through this. Um, the reason I picked it up is I kind of saw it come across. I like the feel of it, and I like the fact that you can write something on here. And when you get so many deck boxes, it's, it's really nice to kind of be able to write on here. And knowing that I was going to see if I can put two double-sleeved Blitz decks in here for Flesh and Blood, I thought I'd give it a try. So let's go ahead, and when you open this, you can tell it's a magnet. And then it's got this little strap to kind of help it keep it secure. Let's see, you've got a divider in here. Oh, that whole thing comes off. I didn't realize that, that's kind of cool. So that whole thing is magnetized. So let's go ahead and grab our blitz decks. So we have our Reiner blitz deck and our Betsy blitz deck with the, and these were the ones that came out of the, um, the uh, pre-bought um, boxes. Sorry there, had a little brain moment there. So let's go ahead and put the Betsy in. And this is with all the cards. This is the tokens. And again, this is double sleeved. Let's go ahead and get these in here. Okay, that fits pretty good. And then we've got the divider that we can put in. Actually, you know what? I'm going to try it without the divider. And then we will do our Reiner deck. I don't know. Do we want to try the divider or not? Let's. I feel like the divider might poke up when I close this, but uh, unless I'm doing this wrong. But let's go ahead and put this one in. Here is our Reiner deck. And again, these are double sleeved. go ahead and there we go oh yeah look at that plenty of space so that's two blitz decks the blitz decks are 40 cards plus the equipment cards plus the uh, token so that go uh, that go fits pretty well all right cool now you can go ahead and write on here if you wanted to but i want to try something real quick and i'm not sure if this pokes up or not so i'm just going to put the divider right here yeah i feel like this would poke up too much so i'm not sure the best place to put this divider yeah i think i'm putting it in the wrong spot but that's okay Let's go ahead and close that. I'll look at the divider later. And I'm not sure how you write on this, but I've seen somebody write on it. I think it was just with a, a dry erase marker that they can pull out there. I like this. If you see, it doesn't open up very much. And then you have the ability to throw this on. And when you strap that on, that's kind of neat. Look at that. It's one of those things where I was uh, shaking it and it's not coming off, but I think this helps it. Um, this is actually the first Quiver product I purchased. Um, 
I usually buy another brand, but again, I saw somebody have this and I thought it was really cool. And I know they have those larger things where you can put a lot of these in here. So I thought I would I'd put these in here. Been playing a lot more Flesh and Blood lately. And if most looks like this would fit an actually commander deck if you're playing Magic. But with playing Blitz, this is perfect. I got two Blitz decks in here. Everything you need um, can write on here Blitz, and then I'll know they're Blitz decks. Um, can fit in the backpack real quick. Again, this is Quiver. Um, this is not a review of the product, uh, but uh, this is just kind of my just general thoughts. I really like this. Um, it was a good price. Um, I think I paid like $22 for it, which I thought was pretty good. And of course, we are finishing off this bottle of Basil Hayden Dark Rye. Um, as I mentioned, I'm a huge fan of it. Let's go ahead and take one more sip. Mmm. So good. Would love to hear your thoughts on Quiver, if you like their products or not. Um, would love to hear in the comment section when it comes to deck boxes and whatnot, what's your favorites and why. Um, and again, you know, check out um, Tolarian Academy, the professor. He does a phenomenal job of, of reviewing all of these types of products. I have yet to find anybody better on the internet um, who talks about it. I've um, been a big fan of his for a long time. And again, these were the two Blitz decks that I was able to put in here out of the box. We've got the Reinar Blitz deck and we got the Betsy Blitz deck. So we were able to pit, fit these in here, double sleeved, everything that came on it. And as you saw, there was room to spare in this. Um, really appreciate everybody taking the time to watch this video. Please like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Um, I think the last time I checked, less than 10% of the people who watch the videos are actually subscribers. Um, we have had a big uptick in the subscriber base. Really would appreciate it if you would, would hit that subscribe button if you like the videos. Like, comment, all that fun stuff. And until next time, everybody, cheers.